these are my system specs. You can pause the video to see details. I have this type of case that has the USB 3.0 on the top and extra USB ports in the front. Turns out my H100 was not working, which it is now. Um, what I did was the case, the motherboard I have has these uh, little USB plugins right here. This is the one for the H100i. This is the one for the ports on the top. And this is just for other things on the top also. What I did was I unplugged these two right here and left the H100i plugged in by itself. Of course, the power was off when I did this. So I'll turn off the power, make sure it's unplugged, push the little power button on top of your computer to make sure all the power is out of the motherboard while it's unplugged. And that's called a cold start. And then you plug it back in and then turn it on. What should happen is with these two unplugged and the computer, with these two unplugged and the computer not on, now back on, the H100i should not be fighting for any resources or competing for resources with the other two. So it should start working again, mine did. It wasn't showing at all. Now I did a little bit of trial and error and I came to find out that my mouse is plugged in over here to the USB 3.0 but before, the mouse is plugged in to one of these slots right here. Turns out that the mouse was competing for resources with the H100i. But for some reason, when I plug in my external hard drive, it, the H100i keeps on working. So it turns out it's just the mouse. The H100i and the mouse somehow don't like each other. They were competing for resources. Um, the external hard drive does not seem to compete for resources with the H100i. So what I did was I plugged these two back in afterward and the H100i continued to work. Just to test things out, I took the mouse out of here and plugged it into here while the computer was running and the H100i software, this fan and the H100i, uh, all, the, all the stuff that related to the H100i on the, um, on the software, it totally froze. Then I shut the software off, the Corsair Link off, turned it back on, and the H100i stuff was not working. It was just totally gone, just not working at all not even showing up really. So I unplugged the mouse from here, plugged it back into here, didn't touch these things right here, and restarted the computer with the mouse plugged in over here. Once again, the H100i started working. H100i started working. So. If that helps you in any way, I hope it does. If not, hopefully you can find something that does. Or you can call, uh, of course, your tech support. Maybe they can do something for you. Before uh, I actually figured all this out, they told me to buy another Corsair Link. So I did. There's the box sitting over there on the floor. Um, turns out mine, I wasn't going to change it out, but mine, once I got this working, Mine only stayed red. It um, had a bad blue and green LED, so I changed it out and now everything works. So I'm sending the broken one back to Corsair. I hope this video has helped you in some way.